Hey, I'm Anthony Falco, and I'm part of the AFJRTC Flight Academy based out of UWF in Florida, Pensacola here. Pretty much we fly every day. It's a pretty sweet gig, honestly. This is an opportunity that not many people get. It's um, 200 selects out of the entire country, and there's over 2,000 applicants. So we're all very fortunate to have this opportunity, and we're out here grinding every day, and we're happy to do it. So we do a lot of ground school. We do a lot of flying, as you can see. We already have three students up in the air. And, um, yeah, it's just a normal day for us. We have uh, nine students on campus. Uh, they basically were, were carefully vetted by the Air Force, you know, and they're here to get their private pilot certificate. So they're going to get uh, six hours of university credit. You know, the, uh, one course is a ground school course that prepares them for the FAA knowledge test. And the other is a flight course that prepares them for the FAA practical test that culminates in a private pilot certificate. I am Natalie Stevens, and I'm part of the UWF Flight Academy this summer. So I'm an Air Force ROTC at the University of Utah, and so I was selected for the program, and I have a pilot slot for the Air Force, so I was really excited to just get some hours in a plane and then get work towards my private pilot license. Huge benefits for sure. I passed my check ride, so I now have a private pilot license, so that's super awesome. Definitely a huge benefit because I can go fly with friends and family and stuff like that. Um, and then also just getting to meet cadets from across the country is a super cool experience because we kind of now have like a web of connections of people interested in going into the Air Force. It's an awesome opportunity and it's pretty rare to come across, so it was definitely an awesome experience just for everyone. If it was easy, anybody could do it. How many of you, a few weeks ago, thought, oh yeah, hey, I could fly, where somebody gave me that opportunity? How many people can juggle 12 things at once? That's what you were taught to do, right? How many can be so calm under pressure that despite what the weather's doing to you, what the radios are doing to you, what the birds are doing to you, what the runway's doing to you, what the fuel is doing to you, can keep all that together? and have a successful mission. Not very many. You truly have demonstrated just when you are capable. The best friendships performed over a common experience. The more difficult the experience, the better the friendship. And eight weeks of this grind, you guys are going to be best friends forever. What you have learned in the last eight weeks is skill, is knowledge. What are you going to do with it now? What are you going to do with it now? That's the question that we're all anxious to see. And so as you go across this stage tonight, and as you accept your wings for the very first time on, on your chest, think about all those people that went before you. Think about the legacy that you carry on. Because at one point, they got their license as well. And they had to go, now what? I can't wait to see what the now what is for this group of nine. But what I do know is that it is not easy. And not everybody can do it. But you can. You truly are the heart of what Junior ROTC is about. You are the heart of what being a fantastic citizen is about, and you are the heart of what our future pilot force looks like. Thank you so much and congratulations. <laughs>